How to Grow a Corkscrew Willow Tree Also known as Wavy Willow or Tortured Willow, Corkscrew Willow, Salix Matsudana Tortusa, is easy to recognize by its long, graceful leaves and wavy, contorted branches, which turn out to be especially noticeable amid the winter. Unfortunately, although corkscrew willow is a fast-growing tree, it isn't extensive and will, in general, be vulnerable to breakage and bug issues. Notwithstanding its downfalls, growing a wavy willow tree is a commendable endeavor, and with appropriate care, you'll appreciate this fascinating tree for several years. Continue reading and learn progressively about how to grow corkscrew willow trees. Wavy willow growing conditions Before growing this tree, you should realize where to plant wavy willow. Corkscrew willow is suitable for growing in USDA plant hardiness zones 4 through 8. The tree builds up a short root framework that remains near the surface of the dirt, so it ought to be planted a safe distance from structures, driveways, sidewalks and sewer lines. Plant wavy willow anytime amid spring or summer. Wavy willow isn't fastidious about soil and adapts to clay, loam or sand. Similarly, it tolerates either sun or partial shade. However, ideal conditions for this tree are very much drained, soggy soil and full daylight. Corkscrew willow care, for the most part, corkscrew willow care is minimal, however, the tree likes dampness. Water regularly amid the primary year, at that point water liberally amid times of sweltering, dry weather. A 2 to 3 inch layer of mulch will help keep the dirt damp, helps hold weeds within proper limits, and shield the storage compartment from damage by weed trimmers and lawn mowers. However, leave a couple of creeps of bare ground round the base of the tree, as mulch that heaps up against the storage compartment can attract a variety of bugs. Corkscrew willow generally requires no manure, yet in the event that growth appears weak, you can apply some balanced dry compost around the tree each spring, at that point water profoundly. On the off chance that your tree is near a treated lawn, it probably already gets adequate supplements. Prune corkscrew willow regularly to allow air and daylight to enter the focal point of the tree, as a healthier tree free of damaged or dead branches is less inclined to creepy crawly damage. However, issues to watch for incorporate bugs, for example, aphids, borers, wanderer moths and willow creepy crawlies. How to treat willow scab Willow scab disease causes just minor damage to your trees in the event that they are healthy. However, repeated contaminations may moderate a willow's growth and diminish its energy. On the off chance that you are pondering about whether viable willow scab treatment exists, you'll be happy to hear that it does. You can control willow scab on your backyard willows with a combination of good cultural practices and chemical applications. How to treat willow scab with cultural practices. To begin with, you'll have to trim out all of the tainted parts of the willow tree, including stems and twigs. Keep in mind to clean your pruners with a bleach and water blend to avoid spreading the organism. In addition, Keep your trees lively with adequate irrigation and regular compost. The disease does considerably less damage to healthy trees than vulnerable ones. Finally, legitimately planned fungicide applications can be part of your willow scab treatment. This is especially important if your tree is also tainted by the black canker parasite, 